Let's measure some big rocks with something smaller. You can move the object under the rock to figure out how long the rock is. Once you know how many objects you need, tap on the right number. How many toothbrushes long is this rock? One. Two. Good measuring. How many crayons long is this rock? One, two, three. That's right. How many toothbrushes long is this rock? One, two. That's right. How many dice long is this rock? One, two. Three, four. Uh oh, that's not the right length. Try again. One, two, three. Good measuring. How many blocks long is this rock? One, two, three. Good measuring. How many blocks long is this rock? One, two, three, four. <coughs> Almost. Try again. One, two, three. Good measuring. How many paper clips long is this rock? One, two, three, four, five. Good measuring. How many paper clips long is this rock? One, two, three, four. <coughs> Almost. Try again. One, two. Three, four, five. Good measuring. How many paper clips long is this rock? One, two, three, four. That's right! <laughs> wow, we collected a lot of rocks. They're going to make the most beautiful collection. This is a pan balance. You use it to tell how heavy something is. Put rocks on one side and copper weights on the other side. And once the two sides are the same, press the green check button. Let's try another rock. Awesome! Your rock weighs the same as the copper weights. Now let's try another rock. Let's try another rock. Well done. Now let's try another rock. Surprise! Sometimes the smallest rocks can be the heaviest. Now let's try another rock. What a 
surprise! Sometimes the smallest rocks can be the heaviest. Now let's try another rock. Yay, you're right! Uh-oh, that's not a rock. <laughs> oh well, let's weigh it anyway. I want to know how heavy it is. Try another rock. <laughs> Try adding more weight. You did a great job. Now let's try another rock. Uh-oh, that's not a rock. <laughs> oh well, let's weigh it anyway. I want to know how heavy it is. Yay, you're right! Now let's try another rock. What a surprise! Sometimes the smallest rocks can be the heaviest. 